what gets me out of bed in the morning is is the drive to be the best and it doesn't matter if I'm I'm a high school lacrosse coach or I'm the owner of, of Deepwater Subsea I always strive to be the best and if being the best means I'm up at 4:15 every morning and I'm at the office and, and I like to use the term you know hustling and grinding that's what we do but but what gets me out of bed in the morning is being able to deliver to the industry quality information and to develop the guys that are in the field. And I know I keep talking about the guys in the field, but I've been there and I know it's a lonely feeling when you want to progress in your career and there's nobody out there that's willing to help you. Even when you have your senior sub C's or your technical support guys in the office, they're so busy with everything else that goes on in the day to day that they're not going to spend time with you to actually help develop you. So what gets me out of bed in the morning is that one guy who's sitting out there waiting for us to, to put out a webinar, to put out some information, to put out a video and actually help develop them in their career. So what keeps you up at night? Competition. Because I know if I'm not working hard, someone's going to pass me by. And someone can come up with the same ideas that we have, but the reality is, is you have to think outside the box. And what drives me to be the best and to keep me up all night long sometimes, 24 hours, is just the drive to, to be better than everybody else. And part of that is developing myself. I know where my strengths and weaknesses are, and I focus on those. And if it's understanding competency assessments, or if it's understanding Bloom's taxonomy, if it's understanding the science of learning, it's almost an obsession to want to know as much as possible. So what keeps me up at night is the things that I don't know. Because if I don't know it and somebody else does, then that means they're out in front of me. And, you know, I know it's a movie and it's kind of a, a joking comedy, but if you ain't first, you're last. And, you know, for me, being first is, is extremely important because I don't like downtime. I don't like seeing guys suffer in their careers. And if I can stay up late studying to help them better at their jobs, then I'll stay up 24 hours to make sure that they don't suffer one hour of downtime in the field.